safe spot, cause why would there not be? Uh, okay, so then, well, if there isn't, I'll feel like a fool. Uh, no, there's, there's extra levels here, cause we, we went up, we went to this area before, so pop a save, and then there's a door. If it's not by the door, then I'll pop a walk a bump, and that's all. I, that's all the healing I really need. Uh, I guess there isn't. All right, well, I'm pop a wobble bump. I I look at that. I lost 25 FP in that fight. Waka, the perfect waka. amount for a walk a bump. The and then 99 experience points hurts my soul. Something fierce. Let me tell you that. All right. Um. All right. Welcome to the final battle here. Welcome to the final battle between good and evil, or something. Until the next Paper Mario game. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to your nightmare! Behold, this green button on the floor! You can thank me, Mario! Since you've been my rival for so long, I've arranged a special arena for your defeat. But bam Look at the floor! There it goes! It's all wavy! Look at that! It's falling away! Ha 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 ha! you like it? You're completely trapped! How does it feel, huh? You have no choice but to be my boyfriend now! <laughs> you fell right into our trap! And you call yourself a hero? <laughs> Did you think we were foolish enough to just sit back and watch as you save the star spirits? I put together a little surprise for you. A device that increases Bowser's power. King Bowser will be so powerful that not even the power of the star spirits can compare. He'll now truly be invincible thanks to my wisdom. Are you ready, my king? Then power up! <laughs> yeah, so it's, uh... It's it's a fully operational death pillar that makes Bowser into a god. Or at least I think it's the core concept of it. By which I mean Bowser gets bigger and he... Is he going Super Saiyan Blue? Is that what he's doing? Oh yes, Kami Koopa, that was incredible. I feel like I'm exploding with power. I took a little blue pill and now I'm fully ready to explode all over that cheeky plumber. Okay, you're a Mario. You're going to be my boyfriend whether you want it or not. It's not gonna be like before. Prepare to be beaten. I'm into BDSM. Okay, um, so if I recall, we cannot deal damage to him in this fight. Oh, we can deal damage to him, but at a certain point, uh, oh, I'm the wrong button. Uh, at a certain point, he's gonna uh, switch over to super invincible mode, and ow! Uh, well, that sucks, but uh, that's okay. Because we, we have all the healing items in the world. Uh, and I think we start back at full health when the fight officially re-begins. If not, I got all the healing items in the world, so I don't really care that much. <laughs> Time to increase my power with my good old star rod. I stick it up my butt. That's what lets me do things longer. Here we go. Look at all the star power there. See? Okay, so... Um, the star beam no longer will work, if uh, I'm remembering correctly. Uh, which is very sad, because really it's only useful one time in that regard. Yeah, <laughs> you idiot! That weak attack doesn't affect me anymore! What's the matter? Why won't the star beam work? Uh, yep, so... But meanwhile, Princess Peach gets to actually do something! Oh no, brave Mario! What can I do? The way things are going, Bowser will surely defeat him. Somebody please help Mario. Why do you have to constantly run your mouth? Keep quiet. Ow! <laughs> no, Princess Peach, are you all right? I'll get you out of those ropes. There you go. Twink, I'm so glad you're okay. And you actually keep bravery. Do you like the, uh, the lion and uh, that thing that probably isn't in this universe? You insolent little star kid! How dare you! <laughs> yep, so, uh, Peach gets to be in a fight. Kind of, generally. You little whippersnapper! You're too young to fight me! I... I... am not afraid of you! I like sneak attacks, though! I should be a rogue! Uh, but anyway, I can do a dash! Ready? hey -ya! <laughs> Did I just feel a breeze? Was that really your attack? <laughs> Uh, but Peach can focus and give power to Twink. Uh, the power of 
Not friendship. Not friendship. Uh, so she can do that, and it's just like, ow. Uh, but he doesn't have HP, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, but now he can start dealing damage. Ow, why you little? So you can fight a little. <laughs> okay, so then, yep. So you're kind of seeing what this is here. Twink is learning the power of friendship, and he's being powered up. <laughs> Uh, meanwhile, Cammy uh, relies on her own power and is therefore, uh, you know, kind of slowly becoming useless. I guess it's a metaphor for that. I don't know. Yeah, what's going on? Why does it seem like this little star kid is getting stronger? <laughs> uh, I mean, I, 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 in the context of what it is, like, I, I do like that this is a thing. Uh, I, I do... First of all, I like the concept of Kami Koopa just in general and always have. But also, like, because Twink really has been kind of useless throughout the game, if we're being honest. Like, he gives, he gives advice, but I mean, I, I guess it's not nothing, but I mean, I, I don't know. But yeah, I, I, th th this is kind of like, because, uh, like, th they're using the power of friendship in order to, uh, in order to defeat Kami, which I think works pretty well overall. It can't be! My attacks don't work! Oh no, oh no! Now I remember! The stars get all their power from ordinary people's wishes! Peach's wishes are giving that little star kid power! <laughs> yep, they sure are! Be prepared to take this! Well, bam Uh, Kami Koopa only had 10 HP. That just makes me sad. King Bowser, I have failed you! <laughs> uh, yep. So that happened. Uh, but we still need a way to stop Bowser's power. Oh, we did it! We did it! Twig, now I must save Mario! But what can I do? I know, Princess Peach! Make a wish! Just like you did for me! It's like Earthbound! Do you remember Earthbound? It's like Earthbound! Ma it's like Earthbound! Make a wish to get more power to the Star Spears! Think of the Mushroom Kingdom, Star Haven, Mario! It's like Earthbound! Make a wish! You know, you know Earthbound? Did you play Earthbound? I did, and I heard that game stinks, but I'll try! I'll go help Mario! Alright, yep, so... Using the power of people's friendship and wishes! Uh... We can do something. God, what's the matter, Mario? Feeling a bit under the weather? I mean, you know, you're gonna be my boyfriend whether you like it or not. Ow! What the hell is that shit?! Oh my, I feel power flooding into me. <laughs> Honorable Star Spirits, I'll do what I can to help! Twink! What a surprise! I feel the wishes of Princess Peach and all the Mushroom Kingdom are giving us power. Perhaps now we can match Bowser's strength. <laughs> now, Mario, don't give up! Everyone's behind you! Receive our power and do your best! Power up the Star Beam! All right, so we get a more powerful star beam using the power of everybody's hopes and dreams. It's now the peach beam. Mario can use the peach beam. D what's going on? All right, uh, let's try that final fight again, but differently. Mario, are you still standing? You didn't just give up and submit to being my boyfriend. You'll never beat me. <laughs> oh, I guess like, all the damage I did did yeah. carry over, which is helpful. Uh, oh yeah, I, I fucked it up and should have done the thing. Um, eh, we'll, we'll do out of sight because uh, I'm embarrassed about my poor decision making. I want to be hidden! I mean, did I really need to do it? Probably not, but that's okay. I did anyway. <laughs> if only it makes Bowser unhappy that he can't hurt me. <laughs> Bowser is upset that he can't be my boyfriend, so or I won't be his boyfriend, so that's why he's doing that. <laughs> Okay, uh, so, yeah, so we got a super pe powered up star beam with our friend Twink. Gah, you've got to be kidding me! My star rod power is gone! <laughs> Alright, he's gonna use. Yep. Alright, so it's it's something I gotta. Well, no, it isn't. I have four what I have four life mushrooms. I don't care what you can do to me, Bowser. Goodbye! <laughs> um, uh, I think you have defense, right? I'll, I'll, I'll spend a turn figuring that out. I think he's got defense. Yep. Okay, he's got he's got two defense, so that was worthless. Uh. Okay. Yeah. So. Okay. 
Yep, I don't care what Bowser can do to me. He really can't do much to me. So let's just uh, swap out. Um, Watt is the probably the better play. Yeah, because Watt's gonna deal five damage regardless. So we'll we'll get through the final battle with Watt here. Watt is uh not our MVP. That would be Bombat, but yeah. So uh. I mean, at this point, there's literally not a single reason on Earth why I need to heal. <laughs> and I'm not going to run out of FP either. So, yeah. So, we're basically on autopilot. The battle's not over yet. Watch this as I become invincible. Ow! <laughs> okay, well, that's fine. You hurt my bro, but uh, I have no reason to not attack. Bye. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, you're using the... Uh, Okay, so he's, he's, he's powering up again. Now that's a big deal, but I'll use the Peach Beam again. Uh, I, and I still really like this fight for what it is. It, it's a lot of HP you gotta deal with. The, I just didn't realize I'd have four life mushrooms at this point, so I don't really care that much about healing, I'll be brutally honest. Because <laughs> if I did, I would have healed. Uh, yeah, so... But I'll get a refund on the life shroom, and... Uh, if I want to do any more post-game stuff, because uh, I beat all the mini bosses at this point, so unless I really just want to do the badges, it's probably the end of my playthrough anyway. So, um, I got so, so power jump. Uh, he probably has a heal ability too at some point in the equation. Uh, yeah. So, yeah. So, but uh, I mean, I really love this game still for what it is. Th Thousand Year Door takes this concept and runs with it even farther, which is great. Uh, and Bug Fables, too. Bug Fables is also good if you've not played Bug Fables. Uh, oh, I don't have the refund badge on. That's fine. It doesn't matter that much. Um, but yeah, no. It just... I, I mean, every part of Paper Mario is great. It inspired so many other things that made turn-based battling still fun. And I still think turn-based battling is fun. Uh, oh, you bitch, you're gonna make the fight go longer. <laughs> Fine, I'll keep murdering you. I'll keep, I'll keep filling here while I have a, not a boring fight, but like, I'm not even compelled to try to heal. Okay. <laughs> I, I'm not, I'm not compelled in any way to try to heal. <laughs> I, I still have two health mushrooms, so I, I just don't care. <laughs> uh, Peach Beam. Like, like I've said this before, and I'll say this again, like, it, it doesn't take away the fact that these games exist, uh, that Origami King is doing a different thing. I wish Nintendo would go back and do this again. I feel like they've learned from the lessons of, uh, well, I, I feel with certainty that hurt a lot. God damn. <laughs> uh, yeah. I'm gonna keep a. Do I want to keep a mushroom in the back pocket? I think I do, just in case this battle goes on a lot longer. So let's let's go back to max health here, uh, ju just in case. Just in case, we still have one more. We still have one more life room. And, and if I was playing this battle with any level of uh, seriousness, I would have healed and kept all my shrooms in case I needed them. <laughs> but I mean, the truth of the matter is, one more set of hits and he's dead. Well. Unless he keeps making the fight go on for fucking ever. Way to go, Bowser. Fucking Brit of this fight. <laughs> um, yeah. But I mean, it's, 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 this is, this fight, this is a good fight for the most part. It, it it's, heal, heal 30 kind of sucks a bag full of dicks. Uh, yeah, and it's fine. <laughs> Watt Watt is only capable of doing so much anyway. So, uh, bam. Uh, that's a good amount of damage right there. Uh, hopefully they can. I mean, he is basically a 159. My God! Please tell me that's the last time he can heal the full. That sucks. <laughs> like that, that, that's his, this is his, uh, this is a slog. Particularly because he keeps doing this shit too. Like, I hope he can only heal three times. Like, that's his max. Cause that's, oh my God, that's that's almost 200 health. I've had to chill away at his shit. 
Ugh, good lord. And at the very least, it gives us an opportunity to see all the star spirits again and again. I, I wish Mario Party 5 was better because it utilizes all the Paper Mario star spirits. Uh, unfortunately, it's the worst of the GameCube Mario Party, sadly. <laughs> uh, bam! Okay. Uh, I don't need to heal right now. I'll heal later. Uh, yeah. Bam! Here, here's hoping that's the end of him healing 30. <laughs> uh, I will pop a, pop a heal 20 just in case. I'm very glad I healed when I did because, uh, I didn't realize he was going to heal two more times after that, for fuck's sake. Okay, heal. I, I guess I've used, despite me not really finding a lot of use for that power, it turns out I've used it twice in the final battle. So I guess it's, I guess it's not that bad of a power. Although I do have <laughs> items I could have used instead. Ow! Alright, well that was Bowser's last stand here. So, BAM! Uh, I can only think of one way I know how to end this playthrough, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna end it with... EXPLOSION! BAM! <laughs> Perfect. Okay. I thought Bowser's head was gonna come off weirdly enough. It kinda looked like it was going to. Oh, no! Mario defeated me! He always defeats me! But this time I became invincible I still couldn't beat him! Darn it! <laughs> Okay, that's the end of Bowser's bullshit here. We got the Kirby Star Rod! Oh, that would be the Star Rod. Um, it's almost... I think the Star Rod in Smash Bros. is based on the Kirby one, but I still like the Star Rod as a concept. Oh, Mario! For a second, I thought that was Bowser. It was just like, he was adopting, like, uh, he wanted Mario to be his boyfriend canonically. I knew you would save me! Thank you, Mario! Uh, but unfortunately, the, the, the everything's blowing up for no reason! Uh, I'm awake! What, what's going on? This is part of the plan! Uh, alright, so yeah, the whole base is blowing up, but, uh... I don't know why Bowser's walking over there. Oh, just, just slow walking. Kimmy, what's with all the shaking? Ah, your kingship. The battle with Mario was so intense that my device for increasing your power seems to have started malfunctioning. It's entirely screwed up and its power appears to be heading back into your castle. I hate to tell you this, but both your castle and the spot right here are about to explode. You must free my evil king. We have no choice. Don't you, are you... Really? That's a big problem. Let's get out of here right... Huh? Well, here's the explosion. I mean, my explosion was so powerful, I blew Bowser into the sky like Team Rocket. There he goes. Uh, but it seems like Bowser's castle's exploding. <laughs> Which, I mean, you know... I gotta say, the spinning balls of death never really came into play like you think they would have. Like, that's like the most iconic thing about this iteration of the castle situation. And it just never happens in a way that means anything. Uh, oh yeah, Mario and Peach are definitely dead. Is that, that's just the end of the Paper Mario, everybody. Mario and Peach died. I'm joking. They're fine. They're fine. Look, look at them. There they are. They're they're being protected by bullshit magic. What what a what a proper way to uh to finish the game. And now we can go back to Peach's castle and set it back on the ground gently. All right. Give the old man the star rod back. <laughs> oh, Mario, thank you. You did it. You brought back our precious star rod. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. We're here to bring peace back to this world. <laughs> uh, they all going to say something about... Yeah. Now I'll be able to grant everyone's wishes again. Praise Xenu. All of this is thanks to you, Mario. When you look at the night sky, you'll know that the glittering stars are praising you for your courage. And also, you used my power 89 times over the course of this adventure. Kudos! Hey, you used my power one time, but that's okay. You're not really much of a gym bro. But I mean, you know, I believed in you, Mario. Hm. You also said my power was useless. But guess who helped you in battle? I guess you could have also just used your items, but... Uh, fuck you. I hope Bowser learned something from all this. Maybe he'll behave himself now. Although I'd say the chances of that are pretty slim. Also, you never used my power. Fuck you! 
Yeah, you ought to said my power is worthless too, I gotta say, but I'm thankful for everything you've done. Open return to Mushroom Cage, where's your damn Mario? And Tweak, I must say, oh, fuck my, <laughs> switching to my old person. And Tweak, man, I say you really rose to the occasion. You proved yourself to be a grown-up star. Ah, oh, go on, praise me more, bitch. Well, I think it's time to return to Star Haven. All the stars are waiting for a third, no doubt. It's time to say goodbye from now, Mario. May the stars ever shine brightly upon you. Goodbye. 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 Praise you. Goodbye. 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 <laughs> okay, there they all go. And now it's time to say goodbye to Twink. Mario, I'd like to thank you, too. And Princess Peach, it was an honor to help you in your time of need. I well, hope maybe to see you again sometime. You know, if Shigeru Miyamoto is not a bitch. For now, I'm gonna become a respectable star when people's wishes come true. I'm probably gonna edit that one out. <laughs> Thank you, Twink, for helping me. You're a stellar friend to me. <laughs> yeah, Princess Peach. Uh, I enjoyed being your beta orbiter male. It was a great experience, but uh, I had to go now. Bye. Uh, goodbye. Up into the stars. Praise Inu. <laughs> That's, that's my character arc now. I'm a Scientologist. Here I go. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah. All right. Uh, I guess they're still in the, the, they're still fucking in the, 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 I guess, I guess Princess Peach's castle is just now fucking in space forever. <laughs> that, that, that's kind of fun, I guess. I don't know. I, I like that. That's kind of fun. <laughs> I know it's not. I know it's not. Uh, and there goes Twink. Uh, off to become a proper Scientologist, I guess. <laughs> All right. Uh, yep. So now Princess Peach's castle is just gonna fall on the, just gonna fall to Earth. <laughs> or I guess, yeah. Oh, so that's it, huh? That's how you took the star back from Bowser's spiders. Uh, it seems like another wild adventure's in the books, bro. That movie's gonna be so fucking weird. Castle's back and normal as everything return home safely. Pimmy Sylvia! You came through in the end just like you always do. I know you've been back for days now, but I bet you still kind of feel like you're on an adventure, don't you? Don't you? That reminds me, the pals who travel with you. I wonder what they're up to right now. Spiders! <laughs> uh, so we get a nice little coda with everybody. Uh, Goombario, who... We used a lot at the beginning for tattling, but you know, whatever. Go Mario! Get your little ass! Oh, it's Perry Carey. Oh, hey, hey Perry Carey, what's up? I thought you were back at work delivering letters. Haha, <laughs> I sure am. This is a social call. I got a Budweiser here and I'm drunk and shit. It's a Princess Peach. Here you go. Nah, letters done, job all done. Huh? From Princess Peach? Whoa, what's she writing to me for? We're here to find out. I gotta deliver more letters and I'm drunk. Goodbye! Thanks, Paracarry. See ya. Keep working hard, buddy. Take care. <laughs> hey, Goombaria. What did Princess Peach find her letters? Let me see. Hang on, Goombaria. Jeepers, this is an invitation to a party at the castle. It says the princess is having a party, and I'm invited to go have fun. Whoa! <laughs> uh, so, yep, yeah, so... Uh, that's the only one we get uh, things from. There's context clues for things, I guess, uh, functionally. Uh, stuff's happening here. Uh, Lady Bo's getting uh, it's getting stuff. Wad, I guess, just lives in the toy box now. That's his life now, I guess. Uh, yep. So, Sushi's getting one. Yeah. All, all, all of our friends are getting one. But only one of them has the opportunity to speak. Actually, Coops didn't get one. We just saw Bombette in the village, didn't we? Huh? Uh, yep. All right. So it's a different time. It's a it's a party. It's it's a Mario party. We're gonna have Mario Party Three in there. Oh, there's Cooper. Uh, oh, yeah, so he's on an expedition. Now then, gentlemen, it's time to scale the frosty heights to Crystal Palace. Cooper, old boy, you're in charge of guiding us. Your prior experience is terribly important to the success of our expedition. Huh? Yeah, leave it to me. I know the place front and back. Press circle to enter the vault code. Cooper! Hey, I've been looking all over for you. Pirate Carrie, what brings you here? I finally made it. I have a letter for you from Princess Peach. Here you go. It's a bunch for you. 
All right, well, there you go. You can read or do whatever you want on it. Uh, oh, wow. Order of the invitation to a huge prison party at Prince Peter's Castle. It's directly for the princess herself. It's got her signature on and everything. Well, there's no way I can miss a patch this big, but, uh, but I can't turn my back on this expedition after our professor from Colorado. I just stay here and... Oh, poppycock, boulder dash. Don't be daft, dear boy. Turning down such an invitation will be terribly impolite. This is a golden opportunity. Go to the party this instant. Don't spare me another thought. It would ruin the party if the hero of Cooper Village, nay, the hero of the Mushroom Kingdom, wasn't even there. God, well, I knew you'd say that, Professor Colorado. You're so kind and generous. I'll do it. I hope you guys will be all right without me. I'm going to go party. <laughs> Off I go. <laughs> oh, well, Colorado, I have a message for you as well. Don't bother coming back home, you water buffoon. What a no good husband. That was a message from your wife. Colorado, you let all this explanation when I tell your wife again, didn't you? Boy, they were so furious. Oh, goodness gracious. Prepare, Carrie. Why in the world didn't you tell me this first? This is a crisis, old boy. I must wait back home with all due speed. Off I go. Uh, yeah, they don't know what the fuck to do now. Uh, okay. I guess we'll leave. Uh, oh, huh? Do you hear something outside, Maria? I think it did. I think it was cats outside. I you know, it's all the cat food I eat and stuff. I'll go take a look for it, okay? <laughs> all right. Maria's just gonna chill, sit here chilling. <laughs> hey, bro, guess what? Paracary stopped by a drama of princess party of a teacher for Mrs. Peach. It's, it sounds like we're in a time loop or something. Like, you know, it's like, but uh, we are going to anyway. Yeah, here we go. All right, uh,. It's a time loop. Remember how this is how we started the game? Uh, remember, rem remember all the good times we had doing this at the start of the game? And, uh, uh, yeah, remember how we wandered through Toad Town on autopilot? Okay, listen, Mario, I'm just gonna run ahead. There's some important stuff that I have to do. What is it? Top secret. All right, here I go. Goodbye. Uh, yeah, this is an opportunity for us to say goodbye to. All of our favorite characters, like these Toes, and those Goombas, and those guys. Uh, but I love Chuck Quizmo, so here we go. Cowiz, it's your old pal Chuck Quizmo. I'd like to take part in the quiz game. Nah, just kidding. Let's enjoy the party. All right, I love Chuck Quizmo, so there we go. Uh, I, do I really care to say goodbye to anybody else in this world here? Uh, oh, this fucking asshole. All right, but it's from Koopa Koop. By the way, we're in Castle. I've been there for a while, and I'm having the darndest time you can find the front door. I'm not fucking helping you. Suck my dick. Um. Okay. Um. We, we, let's talk to Colorado. See how he's doing. Greetings, old boy. Here for the festivities at the castle, eh? I can't say I'm terribly excited about it myself. My heart yearns to go to the Crystal Palace. Yearns, I say. So many mysteries await me and my dizzying intellect. Oh, the pain of it all. You understand my yearning, don't you, old boy? Uh, yeah, Colorado's wife is not happy with him. Uh, oh, Merlin's not home. Uh, that's fine. It's okay. Uh, alright. Uh, yeah. So, I mean, we are, yeah, saying so, mean, we can talk to more of these NPCs, I guess, but they don't have a lot of interest to say. Mario, welcome to the castle. The Princess Peach should be here very shortly. Uh, and now Princess Peach. But that was very shortly. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there she is. Uh, does she have things to say? Greetings to you all. I'm so glad we can be here on this special day. Star Red stolen by Bowser has been returned to its rightful place in Star Haven. Beans has returned against the Mushroom Kingdom. Above us, the star is shining with more beauty and power than ever before. Uh, stuff, Mario, Goombario, Cooper, Bombette, Paracary. Bo, Watt, Sushi, Lackalester, and everyone across the lands of the Mushroom Kingdom, mostly all those guys in the hoods, they were helpful. Thank you very much indeed, I appreciate it all. I hope that the Mushroom Kingdom will enjoy peace and prosperity for a long time to come, perhaps forever, or until the next time Mario releases the game. This is my heartfelt wish, it will come true because I said out loud like a dumb bitch. So let's celebrate, enjoy the festivities everyone. All right, well, that, uh, is that it? Uh, feels like it's it. Oh, yeah, that's right. Luigi's leading a band. 
Uh, basically every NPC we met along the way here, uh, we're gonna see them again for one last, one last hurrah, one last hurrah here. Uh, hey, remember those toads with the trumpets? Remember those toads with the drums? Remember the toads waving the Nazi flags? I guess those aren't Nazi flags or something else here. Uh, yeah, so we get to see, uh... Well, there's Lack of Lester, and, uh, oh, there, there's all of our party members. They're in the star float there. Well, look at them all there. Cooper looks like he's having a great time. Bombat looks like she's stoned out of her mind. Paracary seems like he's drunk. <laughs> uh, it's good stuff. Oh, that's nice. It's a uh, Mario World rendition. Uh, Baton Girls, Chuck Quizmo. I love Chuck Quizmo. If that wasn't amazingly obvious by the amount of effort I gave to voicing him and giving him, uh, uh, just quiz stuff. And there are the radical Cooper brothers. Why are they in this parade float? I don't know. Well, now they're gone. Goodbye. Thank you, bombers. Uh, look, there's, uh, there's Colorado and his wife. And the whale, don't forget about me. Uh, it doesn't really make much sense how I'm back in the background, but I guess this technically counts as a parade float. It's the only way I can really do it, I guess. Okay. Ah, uh, yes. The magical Mr. Mustafalis. And, uh, there's Tata Koopa and, uh, his horrible red fin listing. We got the badge guys there. They're going off on their next adventure. Uh, Tata Koopa is probably fine. Uh, oh yeah, there's the buzzy boy. Uh, oh, look at that. I guess it's a buzzy girl. Uh, well, look at that. He's happy days there, indeed. Looks like everything's going his way there. Well, there's the bootler. There's the bootler, indeed. Are we going to see the tree pervert? Where's the tree pervert in this little parade? There should be a tree pervert in this parade. I feel like it's only appropriate. Uh, well, it's me, Tabo Blubba. And it's me, the hot what? I get back here with my body, you bastards! <laughs> uh, oh, uh, we can, we're a uh, crikey, we're all out of order here. But our boss is stuck in this tree. We don't know what to do. Oh, his pants are red and white. Obviously, why did we get? Why did we come to that conclusion? Yes, you dumb bastards. Why did you come to that conclusion? Well, crikey, I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, oh, it's Yoshi's! All the Yoshi's are here. And Raphael the Raven is just fucking hanging out. <laughs> the most, uh, the character who had most everything going on in his life. Uh, it just says Yoshi. I like Yoshi though, so it's fine. Oh, I got the piranha plant there. Yeah, they're kind of going a little out of order. It's fine though. Uh,. Uh, I mean, I, I always love the character lines at the end of these things. They're, they tend to be kind of fun. It, it, it's just kind of a fun thing. Oh no, all the little Yoshi boys are going to get high off the clouds. Somebody stop them from doing drugs. Somebody stop them from doing drugs. Hey, it's me, the pervert. Oh, well, you licked me too. Oh, all the Yoshis are getting high. That's a bummer. Because that's like canonically like a thing they do. Oh, uh, you look tasty. It's me. Remember how I almost killed you? Remember how you had to burn through 100 FP? And look at my other brother, Daryl. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, well, there you go. <laughs> uh, well, this is more problems here. I feel like it just gets complicated. This whole thing is just complicated now. <laughs> uh, that whole thing is just complicated right there. Uh, it's me! I was the anime protagonist! Watch me do battle! Why, you little Eggman Jr., get over here! I am the magical one! Me and my 10 HP! <laughs> huh? Alright, there, there are the hammer boys. Look at them, look at them with dead hammers. Boy, Bowser doesn't look fucking happy. Bowser's... Bow, Bowser's just kind of miserable. Well, that was destined to happen. Uh, Bowser's gonna fucking murder some people. Of that, we can be certain. Yep, there it is. <laughs> uh. 
And we got all of our star spirits. Huh? Oh, we didn't get to see General Guy, though, in the montage. It's fine, he kinda sucks, though. Oh, look at that, we got penguins. I don't think I've ever watched this all the way through, or maybe I saw it all the way through once. Certainly I don't remember a lot of this stuff here. Uh, it's... Oh, okay. It, it just went dark because I was... I didn't have a need to move my controller. Sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, if you're sticking with us to watch, uh... If you're sticking with us to watch the Toads doing violin, uh... At least, at least you get to see them. Uh, and they're the amazing daisies. I probably could have murdered those things at this point in the game, but it was like, nah. And they're all of our, uh, our, our powerful star people. Uh, there should have been seven of them, I feel like. The fact that there's only six feels like a crime, but it's fine. Uh, the sun and the bull bulbs and, uh, yeah. A special thanks to the Super Mario Club. I mean, really, oh, there's the general guy. Here he comes. He's, he's got to be extravagant and full of shit, I suppose. <laughs> yeah, I, or something like that. What the fuck is this thing? Oh, okay, there we go. Perfect. I, this feels this feels very perfect for him. <laughs> oh boy. But yeah, no. Um, again, I love this game. Uh, I, I I love this game. So I I hope everybody had a good time watching it, as I had a good time playing through it. Uh, I I, I hope everybody did. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I, I love how they just kind of trip. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Rob and I had conversations. We're gonna play. Uh, we'll play Mario RPG together. Uh, th that'll be our next one of uh, the Mario RPG games. Before uh, may maybe we can do Thousand Year Door two, but I think at the very least we're gonna do Mario RPG. At the very least, that's what we'll do. Uh, what we got here? Oh, there's Mario and Peach. Well, that's the final. Sh that's gotta be the final one, I guess. <laughs> What, what is their shrine supposed to be? Is it a shoe? Why are they in a shoe? Oh, and Twink's here. Well, isn't that nice? All right. Well, and there they go. They're just fucking off and leaving the parade, I guess. <laughs> They're having sex in the bush or not. They're just walking in the distance. Or maybe they're walking into the distance to go fuck. Maybe that's the answer. Oh, uh, he's taking him to her house. They're going to fuck. <laughs> or not. They're just going to watch fireworks. Oh, look at that. And I think that's the end of the game here. The end. All right, everybody. Thank you for joining us on this adventure. Uh, we'll be back with something new. Uh, probably Earthbound is next on our RPG list. So uh, uh, we will see you guys then for that. Take it easy.